Hi folks, it's Evil here from Thundermist Lure Company and welcome to today's episode of Thundermist Fishing Tips. We're up here just outside of Minden. We're looking for lake trout today. It's a little bit cold. Uh, we brought our huts with us, but we'll see if we can uh, maybe bear the cold for a little while. And I'll show you how we're fishing. We're fishing in about uh, 40 feet of water. And we've got a hook, line, and sinker rig going right now. And uh, as you can see here, I've got the, uh, a couple of T-turns set up there on my line. And that allows my minnows to swim around freely. And the other advantage of using the T-turns on a setup like this, if I happen to get a big fish, my line won't get all twisted up because I've got the uh, inline three-way three swivel there. So T-turns hopefully are gonna do the trick for us today. And uh, basically, I'm just dropping it right down to the bottom. Then I'm gonna bring the sinker up just about an inch off the bottom and that allows my rod to be a little more limbal and uh, it'll uh, detect the hits much, much better than if you leave the sinker right on the bottom. So just right off the bottom, just like that, and you'll be able to feel hits uh, much, much better, especially if I put my rod down uh, on a pail and it'll be kind of balanced on there. And the other thing I like is this rod, is, it's, uh, it's a stiff rod, which is great for, uh, we're out for lake trout, so hopefully we'll get some bigger ones today. And uh, you need something for backbone, for hook setting. And because we're fishing outside, I've got a fishing rod here where the eyes are, are a little bit bigger. And the reason for that is I don't want them to freeze up on me uh, as I'm fishing. So look for a rod with uh, some nice backbone and bigger eyes um, that allow you to fish a lot more comfortably. So we're going to give it a try today, folks. And uh, actually, we're going we're gonna to stay overnight and uh, come back again in the morning and uh, finish the off the weekend out here. It's a beautiful day. It's supposed to go up to uh, zero degrees or a little warmer tomorrow. So uh, hopefully we're in for some good fishing. So stay tuned. Still on, Antonio? Yeah, I've been fighting them for like 15 minutes now. I thought we were supposed to catch those small ones. Antonio, you're on, eh? Yeah, still right on. on. Wow. It's been on for a while. That's excellent. It's doubled right over, still peeling drag. We're fishing 45 feet deep and he's, he's down there. You got just hook, line, and sinker? Yeah. Minnow? Minnows, yeah. And yeah, we drove through a snowstorm to get here, eh, Antonio? Oh, that was crazy. Yeah, it's worth it. I'm running six pound test, so I can't really horse them. <laughs> we got about two feet of ice, too, so really windy out. I'm gonna lose my hands in a second. <laughs> was there a good bite, Antonio? Yeah, it was. I was watching my graph and uh, just watching my bait go up and down, nothing happening, and all of a sudden this big blob came, this big red. And I'm like, oh, that was nice. a big fish. And it was on my line. I looked up at my rod and he was doubling it over. We had a sighting. It looks like a really nice fish. How are the fingers, Antonio? They're not there anymore. I thought it was worth it, but <laughs> it's getting to the end here. I don't know how much longer I can last. It's getting close now. It's starting to, starting to tire out. So am I. We'd have like a 25 minute battle here already. Gaining Antonio? Gaining a lot of line. He's, was, he's starting to give up. I was going to say, it's a good thing I packed a lunch. <laughs> the boatless angler strikes first. That's a big there he fish. It's a good one. That's okay. He not want to lose him, no. Yeah! Hey, hey, hey. Congratulations. Nice <laughs> fish, Antonio. You did a fine job. Your first one, you said, right? First one. Awesome. How's that for a first one? That's pretty good. Do I have you beat? You might. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's 27. 28. 28. There you go. Looks like you got dinner. I gotta warm up. Nice fish, Antonio. Thanks. Fish on. Tiny lake trout. Oh wow. A little smaller than the last one, Antonio. It's a little bit. <laughs> it's my turn now, Antonio, but I think it's it's really small, just like your your other small one. I don't think it's anything like your big one, that's for sure. It was just a real subtle, subtle hit, just kind of a tap, tap. And uh, just as he was kind of taking it, there he is there. Little lake trout. 
Mr. Lake Trout, back you go. Nice little catch and release. Look at that, my minnows are no worse for wear. Although I think I will change up that bottom bait there, right there, put a fresh one on and get it back down there again, see if I can get one like Antonio's. Good one, Phil? Uh, it doesn't feel that huge, but it doesn't feel that small either. Oh yeah, well, actually, it is quite small. <laughs> a nice little laker anyways. About the same size as the ones we got earlier. Yeah, 